It's a lovely picture of me. <laughs> <laughs> I come from uh, I come from Wales, which is a very masculine part of the world. I feel my dad is a very masculine man. He's uh, he's a beautiful man, very blunt though. Before I did stand up, I'd never been in a relationship before, and I said to my dad, "Dad, I'm thinking of doing stand up." And he said, "Well, Robin, a lot of stand ups they talk about having sex or their relationships. So what are you going to talk about?" Piss <laughs> 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 off, Dad. I talk about mum's affair. That's what I'll talk about. <laughs> Hi, if you're both watching. <laughs> <laughs> Wales, beautiful part of the world, amazing place. You should come when there's not a pandemic on. It's uh, my, my favourite thing about Wales is that we have free prescriptions on the NHS. Oh, my God. So, I've been on the pill for four years. <laughs> <laughs> it's just nice to regulate. <laughs> People get very annoyed about the war on men. People have boycotted companies. Gillette got boycotted a few years ago because they had a, like, quite a woke advert where they called out toxic masculinity. Like, I'm, I'm not going to boycott Gillette. It's not going to do them any harm if I do. I shave once every year of vision. <laughs> it's going to do them no harm at all. But I can't boycott Gillette. I'm, I'm not, not going to boycott Gillette. I can't use Wilkinson's sword. Wilkinson swords? I can't use Wilkinson's sword because that's what my friend Barry Wilkinson used to call his penis. <laughs> Brings back some memories, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Mum and Dad, if you're watching. <laughs> I think men change their behaviour when they're around other men, though. Right, stag do is a perfect example. My uh, my stag do started in a Weatherspoons in Cardiff, and then it got worse. <laughs> right? <laughs> Weatherspoons, they're always in these, like, old, grand, beautiful buildings. Like, you've kind of got to respect them. Like, Tim Martin, the guy who created it, like, imagine the balls of that man to go, like, I'm going to create a chain of pubs in old, beautiful buildings. Cool, they're going to be nice inside. No. <laughs> You're going to serve food? Sort of. <laughs> what time are you going to open? 6 a.m. <laughs> drink from 6 a.m. like an airport? Yes. Except no one's going anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah. Come on. Well done. Very good.